Have you ever pondered about the hardness of metals? Ever wondered why some metals can withstand more pressure and wear than others? Well, today we're going to explore the fascinating process that gives metals their hardness. A process known as quenching. Quenching, in its simplest form, is a method of hardening metal. This is accomplished by heating the metal to a certain temperature and then rapidly cooling it. The rapid cooling or quenching alters the metal's crystalline structure, resulting in increased hardness and strength. So how does this process work? Think of the metal as a complex network of atoms arranged in a specific pattern. When the metal is heated, these atoms vibrate and move around more freely, disrupting their original pattern. This state is known as the austenite phase. Then comes the quenching. The heated metal is quickly cooled, often using water or oil. This rapid cooling freezes the atoms in their high energy state, preventing them from returning to their original pattern. The new arrangement of atoms is called the martensite phase which is much harder and stronger than the original structure. There's more than one way to quench a metal, though. There are several types of quenching processes, each with its own unique benefits. First, we have water quenching. It's the most common type, mainly because water is readily available and inexpensive. However, this method can sometimes lead to cracking or warping of the metal due to the intense and uneven cooling. Next, we have oil quenching. Oil cools metal slower than water, reducing the risk of cracking. This method is often used with steel to achieve a balance between hardness and toughness. Then there's air quenching. As the name suggests, this process uses air to cool the metal. It's a slower process typically used for metals like aluminum that risk becoming too brittle if cooled too quickly. Lastly, we have polymer quenching. This process uses a polymer solution to cool the metal. It's a relatively new technique, offering more control over the cooling rate to prevent cracking. Now let's summarize what we've learned today. Quenching is a process that hardens metal by heating it and then rapidly cooling it. This rapid cooling changes the metal's crystalline structure, resulting in increased hardness and strength. There are various types of quenching processes including water, oil, air, and polymer quenching, each with its own unique benefits and drawbacks. By understanding this process, we can appreciate the complex science that goes into making the strong, durable metals that are integral to our everyday lives, from the cars we drive to the buildings we live and work in. Isn't it fascinating to know the science behind something so common yet so crucial? That's the beauty of engineering. It's all around us in things we often take for granted. So the next time you see a metal object, remember the intricate process of quenching that likely played a role in its creation. And that's all for today's topic. May this knowledge quench your thirst for learning more